I'm playing with about 20. What's going on, man? <clears throat> I didn't load it up. Heading on out now. I wanted to uh, show y'all the what's called, but I was dealing with some issues that my memory card was locking all that crap. So it is what it is. But I got it working now, as you see. But now today. I'm heading over there. I'm gonna put the try to put the calipers on. I bought a little brake piston tool thingy where you can push the piston back. A whole little mechanism thing from Amazon. Basically, the one you get from AutoZone for sixty dollars. The long one. I bought that for twenty some dollars from Amazon. So I got that. Have the garage sale right here. I I got that. Um. My mission is to put it, put it all together today and hopefully be able to move it around so I can take it to a mechanic next weekend or something like that because I'm not putting no more damn money into this car until I get a mechanic, a real mechanic to look at it um supposedly the mechanic that next door that I had asked him to look at he was bull I'm gonna stop cussing so much he was BSing so we'll see how it go or whatever um but supposedly he looked at it and said I need like a relay and all that but I, like I said I'm not putting no more money into this car I get somebody else to look at it too because i feel like i'm just buying stuff and i don't know what the exact issue is but i know these calibers to be honest i don't even think the calibers was bad but it's kind of best for me to get your braking mechanisms and everything in order you know so i'll see y'all when i get over there i got a long little drive so yeah i'll see y'all when i get over there and i'll be back all right, there we go. What's going on, man? So, I'm up here dirty. Very, very dirty. We didn't pretty much finish. All we gotta do now is put this brake line back on here. I don't know. It's pretty much finished. We finished. We did this side, which is the driver's side, passenger side. Driver's side front, passenger side front, uh, passenger back. We didn't do the driver back because I haven't got my, uh, what you call it, there. the caliber hasn't come in. But now all we're waiting on to finish for today is the, I didn't do the thermostat. That's, I'm gonna put that in the car. Probably wait till this thermostat go bad or maybe make that the next, next time thing. But, got this bump right here, huge, but, all we're waiting on now is to do this, put this brake line back, and I'm gonna pump the brakes and try to what you call it. Um, I'm not gonna bleed them right now because uh, I'm kinda waiting on that, but we'll see. But I do have to let bleeding thing like good bleeding too, as y'all see. But let me go ahead and show y'all. So, new rotor, I need to wipe that down, but new rotor, New caliber, new brake line. We gotta attach it to the line as you see. You in the middle of screwing it. But we have a meeting going on right now. We got a meeting going on right now. I stepped out of just to do this for y'all. So, but once I finish this little clip, I'm gonna go back. We didn't touch this one. Cause we're waiting on the caliber. The caliber hasn't come in yet. So what I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna put the tile back on, put the tile back on, put the tile back on, and then try to take it for a little test. Take for a little spin or whatever. But so this is the back one that we did do. As y'all see, new caliber, new brake pads, um, new spring back there. I need to put all this stuff together so I can know to ship this back with that. I clean up once we're done. But as y'all see brake pads are in that blue bag right there. Driver side, done. New caliber, new brake line. Everything running smooth. So man, I may see y'all when I come back for a test uh, and let y'all know if I kill myself or not. <laughs> but if y'all see this video, then everything went smooth. I need to get this bad boy on the road if I get all this straight, if it's safe like to drive, then next weekend I'm gonna take it to a mechanic. I'm gonna come over here maybe Friday, pick the car, drive it back home, 
and then Saturday morning drop it to the mechanic and then drop it to the mechanic let them test it out and everything and I, I found out that this car does have a what you call it it does have a driver indicator thing you know how I said that it only has it on the the dash thingy or whatever I found out underneath here it's like up here y'all see it that little gray thing it's a little thing that you can go like to AutoZone and plug in. I'm not 100% sure, but from the little thing that I read, hold on, I pulled the little cap off. It says, diagnostic connector, do not remove. And I, I removed it, but it was hanging from a thread anyway, so. So, and it, it wouldn't start at first because he ain't started in a couple days, so. But, yeah, let me go back to our meeting, then I'll come back to y'all. And I know I told you I the seat broke. So I'm, I'm being ghetto right now. I got my little tire, spare tire back here, holding it up so I can have a little, what you call it. And then as y'all see the, hold on. As y'all see the four tires, one, two, three, four. So when I come back, that'll be put on and we'll be bagging it up out here to go on and give it a test. So thank y'all for hanging in there with me, man. I'm getting this bad boy together, I'm getting content out. I'm trying, I'm trying. I'm gonna put the rest of the car stuff either in here or in the trunk, and that'd be with a cleanup. But let me get back to our meeting right now. So, see y'all in a little bit. All right, so we wrapping up for tonight. Finished all the stuff. Come to find out this driver and brake line or something that's not working because all the driver the passenger side stops driver side doesn't just keeps rolling no brake fluid coming through or nothing so we see it coming out the line we unscrew it is there but the camera documenting it documenting it but for some reason it won't come through the to the caliper you got the light? Nah, nah, you good. So, we're thinking it's either, it's sitting here, when we disconnect up here, it's kind of dark so you can't see, but it ain't closing, it ain't working. So we're thinking it's a defective caliper, which I hope not, or go have somebody look at it, a real mechanic look at it and see, but we'll see. Try to, I'm, I have to have a mechanic look at it, you know, because we we had it sitting up on bricks as y'all seen, and I was like, let's try it. So uh, we started the car up, put it in drive, and it wouldn't stop. The right side stopped, that left side just kept spinning, kept spinning, kept spinning. So I was like, yeah, I don't know, I don't know what's going on. So I was like, oh, there ain't, ain't too many out here tonight. Oh, I see, oh, I see, I see two slabs right there. Fuck what you, uh, fuck what they said, something like that. I think that's that red line call. But, yeah, 
but it ain't too many people out here tonight. At least as of right now. But um, but yeah, I'm about to head home. Um, and I'll see y'all probably tomorrow. If if not, then I'll see y'all next video. Once again, thank y'all for watching. Thank y'all for tuning in. Um, as I build this car.